on numerology and astrology. Now, let me give you an example of how astrology and numerology are way above science. Okay. Now, I'm dying to hear I, all this. I, I love science. I think science is extremely important, but astrology and numerology uh, in some cases have been 500 years ahead of this stuff. Uh, the one example I'll give you is uh, astrologers for centuries said whenever it was a full moon, people acted crazy. Whenever it's a full moon, that's where you got the loon lunatic because people act crazy in the full moons. Even police will tell you this. They get crazy phone calls under full moons. Well, the reason this is, is because 70% of the human body is water. Yes. Liquid. Yes. So what happens is when you have a full moon, it pulls on the tides. So logic would tell you that it would pull under humans in a way as well. That's why humans uh, react. And I'm not saying all of them, but a certain percentage of them act very crazy around full moons because just like the moon is pulling on the tides it's pulling on our liquid energy within us so that shows you that uh, the astrologers knew this five six hundred years ago the science only caught up to this i don't know what what 50 100 years ago so again it shows you just one example of how the astrologers and numerologists were centuries ahead of science in some ways used to be able to use that in, in the court of law Back in the day, it was a full moon type of shit. Like, and that's where the, the werewolf came from. You used to act crazy, and used, like he says, we're made out of water. You know how it moves the tide. It's yeah. supposed to do that too.